Character Counts. Character Counts is a coalition founded by the jo Josephson Institute of Ethics, a nonprofit, nonpartisan, non sectarian coalition of schools, communities, and nonprofit organizations working to advance character education by teaching the six pillars of character trustworthiness, respect, responsibility, fairness, caring, and citizenship. Our vision We the Character Counts Advisory Council envision a community where people of all ages practice values of trustworthiness, respect, responsibility, fairness, caring, and citizenship. Our goals, strengthen personal character traits, build families with character, build a more cohesive community. Your character counts, individual, be aware of personal behavior, model the behavior you would like to see in others, volunteer to become a mentor or a character coach, attend a character counts advisory council meeting, support initiatives and events sponsored by character counts. Your character counts, family, Share your family values with each other. Community member, incorporate the six pillars into your business plate practices. The six pillars of character. Trustworthiness, demonstrate integrity, be honest, keep promises, and be loyal. Respect, value all persons, live by the golden rule, respect others' dignity, privacy, and freedom, be courageous and polite, be tolerant and accepting of differences. Responsibility. Do your duty. Be accountable. Pursue excellence. Exercise self-control. Fairness. Be consistent. Listen. Be open. Be careful making judgments about others. Treat people equally and equitably. Follow fair Caring. Be caring. Be compassionate. Be kind. Be loving. Be considerate. Be cherishable. And be unselfish. Citizenship. Be a good citizen. Do your share, help the community, play by the rules, respect authority and law. This is Jackie Carter, the Character Counts Coordinator for Queen Anne's County. You're going to see another film from our perennial coach at Kennard Elementary, Mr. Steve Scott, with his fifth grade class. And they have been doing some great filming because he believes that our fifth graders have heard a lot about character counts and they need to get that out to the public so they can become teachers of those six pillars. So we hope that you like what they do in this uh, video that you're going to see. They are going to be focusing on bullying, and they're looking at the circle of bullying, which means that it's not just the person who's doing the bullying and the person who is being bullied, but there are a lot of other people who are a part of that circle, and they are the bystanders, only we don't want them to stand by. We want them to stand up and tell the bully this isn't something that we do here at this school or wherever we're at and that we want to help the person who is being bullied and, and, and even help the person who's doing the bullying. So it, it's a community affair and I think maybe you'll get this from this video and I hope you enjoy it. Why did you do that? Because I can. Hey, what That's you doing? That's nice. It is. Hey, what you doing? Who's bullying this nerd? That's not nice. So what are you gonna do about it, crybaby? Leave me alone. You sound like you sound like my little nephew. That's not nice. That's not nice. Stop it. What's going on? None of your beeswax, Luke. Kid, stop being mean to my friend. Miss Poet, yes. Kelly and Danielle are bullying Justin. They are. All mm -hmm. right, let's go see what's going on. Okay. What's going on, guys? Justin, are you all right? Yeah, they're just throwing down my books and pushing Luigi and calling me names. Oh, is that so? Yeah. All right, well, maybe we better talk about this in my office. Come on, let's go. Why were you doing those things to Justin? Because I saw Danielle. I can't hear you. What is it? Because I saw Danielle bullying Justin, and I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny. OK. Danny, why were you doing it? Because I didn't have anything else better to say. Okay. Or you have, oh, all right. Um, and we've been learning about character counts in school. We've been learning all about that. What do you think you could have done, Kelly? Left him just alone in the first place. Okay, left him alone. That would have been a good idea, right? All right, uh, Danny, what do you think you should have done? Um, I should have uh, 
played a board game instead of bothering him. Okay, you could have done that. Played a game, done something different. All right, that sounds good. What do you guys have to say to Justin and Luigi? Sorry, Justin and Luigi. Sorry, Justin and Luigi. It's okay. I'm forgiving. Bullying can have a serious effect. It can hurt and it's unfair. If you see it happening or if it's happening to you, you should get an adult and speak up. And if your friend's doing it, you shouldn't just follow them because they're your friend. Or you shouldn't even bully at all. Respect! Dude, hit it out of your fault. Alright. Ow, what was that for? I was being a baby and we wanted to. I'm not a baby, and that's rude. Really? Yeah. You just, you're a baby. No, Everybody I'm not. Just well, shut if up. If you weren't a baby, no. you wouldn't have even said out. You wouldn't have even be talking to us right now. You're such you're such a baby. What's going on over what? here? No. What's going on over here? Bullying they're us. being they're bullying me. That's not true. That's yes, it's not true. No, it's yes, not. It is. You're, so you're telling when me, they're lying to you. Yes, they are. They're lying to you. No. Yeah. We're, we're not lying. Yeah, yeah you are. Uh, actually. I'm going to threaten it. I'm going to look at the security camera. Okay. Wait, wait, stop. What? Well, we did throw the ball at her. And so, we did hit her in the face. Well, the do you, you might want to, you need to say you're sorry for doing that. Right. We're sorry, Abby, for hitting you and calling you names. It's okay. Bullying is not good and it's not okay. Bullying can damage physically and mentally. If you see it happen or you are a victim, tell an adult immediately. It is not nice. Do not do it. I wonder why those boys start coming near us. I know. It's kind of weird. Hey, why did why did you? Hey, why did you just do that? Because we can. Hey, boys, there's there's water. Water. But that oh. was rude. Because this is the only ball that we yeah. had. No, uh, there's other balls. The there's only it. blue ball. Well, you could have asked. Well, at least we're not <laughs> losers <laughs> like you two. I know. Right. Yes, you guys, that this. hurt my Hey, you want this? Yes, Ryan, I want that. Ryan, you're Ryan. taunting us. Ryan. You're teasing us. That's not very Wait, nice. Wait, what? 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 Oh, so oh my god, Ryan. Oh my god, what are we gonna oh, do? No. Oh my god. This is so scary. Maybe they want the ball. We should call it to a floor. No, can you please just give us our ball back? Is that too much to ask for? No. But that was our ball first and we had it. And we took it from you. Which I was rude. Because You guys are being really nice. And how about we all play together when we all be fair? Because I don't like when we aren't nice to each other. And when we all share, then that's being oh, nice my. and respectful. Yeah, I guess it might work. Uh, whatever. If you are being bullied, try to stand up for yourself. If you see someone else getting bullied, try to stand up for them too. Responsibility! You need to gain some weight. Yeah, you're so skinny, you can only do a cheerio. That's not nice. Well, you have no friends. I do have friends. Your, your glasses make you look like a monkey. No, they don't. No, you don't. Stop mimicking me. Stop mimicking me. Stop. Alex said you cut your teeth with yellow crayon. No, I don't. You tripped over air. No, I didn't. I tripped over my shoelace. That's... Blondies that, that, are... You're blondie. When you get older, you'll dye your hair blonde because blondies are so dumb. No, I'm not. Jordan and Alex keep bullying me. They keep saying that I'm dumb and that I tripped over my shoe. Like, I tripped over air, but it was my shoelace. I'll go see what I can do about that. Boyce, um, Matt, Lynn has been telling me that you guys are bullying her. What? what? That's not no, true. true. She's bullying us. Yeah, it's not nice. She's sounds like a monkey. I proved my screen that you guys She's are bullying me. Um, it says on her screen that you guys were bullying her. It's unfair to me. You guys you need to apologize to her. I'm what sorry. for? Oh yeah, what for? Um, well, you were cyberbullying her. What's cyberbullying? Cyberbullying is where a person, without showing themselves, bully a person online and threaten them and their family. Like, um, let me think for a second. 
yes, um, like I'm gonna come and get you and your family, or they make fun of you and say you're fat. So you guys need to apologize to her right now. Sorry, Madeline. We Sorry, won't do Madeline. it again. We won't do it again. It's I promise. Okay. You guys have to owe a little bit of definition and think about what you did and never cyberbully again. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Why don't we go online and look at some more websites about cyberbullying? Oh, Whoa. that's cool. That's a lot awesome. of information. Yeah, I, I won't do bullying again. Yeah, me either, Alex. Karen! You just got rejected. That's not very nice of me. Do you think I care? But why would you do that to people? Because I can. But that's not very nice. But what are you going to do about it? Mm-hmm. Nothing. Hi, Sydney. Hi. Um, Zach and I were playing ball over there, and then Erica came along and took the ball and threw it at Zach, and then he started pushing him. Okay, I'll do something about it. What is, what's going on? You saw a bull me. Eric, please step outside for a minute, please. Zach, what's happening? <clears throat> well, me and Timmy were playing with the ball, and then he took it from us, and then he threw it at me. Eric, come here, please. What happened? Well, I was just walking, and he, ch he took the ball from me and chucked it. Okay, well, that is not what Sydney and Zach's told me. Well... If you tell the truth now, then you won't get in as much trouble as if you do if you lie. Okay. So, is that, were you lying? Yes. So, what do you have to say to Zach? Sorry. Sorry for? Taking the ball and chucking it at you. Zach, did you, do you accept his apology? Yes. Zach, did you, <clears throat> did you like what he was doing to you? No. Eric, will you stop bullying? Yes. Because Zach didn't like that. Okay. Bullying is not good, and if, it's, if you get bullied, it can cause you to do serious things to yourself. So if you see it, you should tell an adult before someone gets hurt. Oh. Fairness! Hey, why'd you do that? Because I can. Can you help us pick him up? No, what are you going to do about it? Disrespectful, and it's not fun for them. Well, it's fun for me. I know, but we're not supposed to be bullying in the school. Okay. So you're gonna have to get a phone call home. Okay. Okay. Hello, this is Mr. Ogus. Um, 
I'm the principal of Kennard Elementary School. Your son Eric has been bullying these two girls for the past couple of days, and we don't tolerate bullying in this school, so he's going to have an in-school suspension for one day. Okay? Thank you. Okay, so say sorry to them again for what you've done. Sorry. Well, this again? No. Okay, thanks. Bullying is not good if it, if you see it or you are a victim, tell an adult right away. It really hurts to be bullied and it can harm people forever. The memory of being bullied stays with the victim even if the bully apologizes. Don't follow bullying and don't let it happen. Citizenship! Cyberbullying is bullying that takes place using electronic technology. Examples of cyberbullying include mean text messages or emails, rumors sent by email or posted on social networking sites, and embarrassing pictures, videos, websites, or fake profiles. To learn more about bullying or cyberbullying, go to stopbullying.gov, stopcyberbullying.org, cyberbullying.us, or growinguppositive.org.